see. Uh, Milos says, Mr. K, is there a way to tell Kijun Sen can hold as support or resistance or if the market will blow all the way past the Kumo? Um, there is no way. There is no way to tell, actually. Uh, simply, we have to monitor chart and when it breaks, when the market breaks the Tenkan Sen, then it may go down to Kijun Sen. And when, it, when the market breaks Kijun Sen, then it may go down to the Kumo. That's all I can say. Yeah, we can't really expect these uh, future markets, how it's moving, whether the market breaks Kijun Sen or not, whether the market breaks Kumo or not. There is no way to tell. And you don't have to know. You don't have to know whether the market breaks Kijun Sen or not, or Kumo or not. Uh, simply when it does, you follow. Simply when the market breaks resistance, you follow. When the market breaks support, you follow sell. Otherwise, you stay away. Because nothing is predictable in this market. Yeah. Yeah, you know, this is actually based on my experience also. And, you know, you have to know really deep in your soul about this mindset. Yeah, we, there's nothing to predict in the future. Like as Goichi also says, we, we, are, we are not here to predict the future, but we are here to see the market as of now. And that's all we can do. But if you understand the market correctly, in terms of how the market has been moving so far, all the way back here, let me check the take the full hour. Uh, if we know how the market has been moving up to, until today, the history. If you know the history, and if you know the presence of the market as of now, how the buyers and sellers are doing on the short term to mid term to long term, then you know what to do. Is the idea of the Ichimoku original teaching. And I 100% agree with that. Because in the future, we can't see. So the market is retracing back now in the 4 hour. So I say, when the market retraces, when the Kijun Sen flat, I say the market may retrace back to Kijun Sen. But I will never say the market will retrace back to Kijun Sen. I never say that. I, I say market may retrace back to Kijun Sen. Um, if, because if you believe when Kijun Sen flat, the market reverse back to Kijun Sen, then if the market goes up in the middle of nowhere, if the market goes up from here, then you can't, you, you, you don't know why. You don't know why the market suddenly goes up before it touches the Kijun Sen. So it's better not to believe like a uh, in what condition what happens because forex or trading is not always like one plus one equals two one plus one equals sometimes zero or sometimes three or sometimes 2.1 this subtle difference makes us very uh profitable i think this uh, this the way of thinking like this makes us really profitable but it's also true that the market goes through the Kijun Sen. So when you see Kijun Sen, the market goes through up and down through the Kijun Sen. So that is true. So right now it's retracing Kijun Sen flat. So I think the market goes backwards. It may break the Tenkan Sen and goes down to the... Uh, the Junsen. That's possible. I hope that makes sense. I hope that makes sense. But there's a tendency. There's a tendency. For example, if Kumo is thick, then it doesn't really break. The market does not really break the Kumo when, it, when the Kumo is thick. That is a tendency that we can tell. Like here, the market breaks the Kumo where, the, where it's very thin. It's easily penetrated. But when the Kumo thick like this, it doesn't break, but it was held, it supported, and it goes towards 
the opposite direction. Um, this is a tendency that we can tell by the Kumo. Uh, and also when Kumo is thin, the tendency is that the market is overheating. So it may retrace. And when it retraces, or a Kumo thick thin, then the retracement can be very, very uh, aggressive. It's also true due to the tendency. So there are some tendencies, but nothing is 100% is also true. And yeah, we all have to see charts and analyze and take trades in this mindset. Nothing is 100%. Otherwise, you can you can't you you will confuse yourself like. You know, Kay said, when Kumo's up, Kijun-sen up, she calls my back candles, it's bullish. He, sa he said that the market is bullish, the market should go up. But when it, when it really retraces, you can't come up with the reason why. Because you, you believed too much on one strategy. But if you keep doing it, then, uh, yeah, it becomes harmful in terms of the money and also the psychology thank you for watching the video until the end and before ending this video i would like to add one more thing that is important in psychology and this is my favorite and the proverb is never try to get a head and tail of the fish and only get the body part of the fish because that's where the juice is and what this really means is that sometimes you may try to capture the pips from the beginning until the end of the trend. And, but you have to remember that that is impossible to get all the pips from the, the beginning until the end. You can only get the body part because that's where the juice is. And that's why whenever you see trends, you better think where is the head and where is the tail of the big fish of the trend and only try to get the body part so that means uh, you can after you confirm the trend happening you enter the market but that will be too early you have to confirm the trend continuous trend uptrend or downtrend but never try to get the beginning of the trends also whenever the market goes flat in sideways after the big trends you never exit just because the market retraces that retracement might still be up temporary and the market may go up continuously but sometimes market goes backwards heavy and maybe reverse end wave maybe some kind of reverse confirmations and the market start to go down continuously then you exit there with some profit so never try to get the head and tail of the fish is actually that is very important and my strategy is built in this way so hopefully you stick to this idea and become a successful trend follower so until i see you on the next one please stay healthy and stay safe and stay gold all right bye for now matane thank you